says he's from Las Vegas, Nevada, going against the Avenger. Now, I'm familiar with a tag team known as the Avengers from Georgia, and I don't know if that's number one, number two, or even if he's a part of that tag team. I don't think so, Craig. The Avengers in Georgia are uh, a much smaller tag team than this particular Avenger here. But there's no getting around the soul taker. I don't care how big or how little you are. Take a look at this guy. Look at the tattoos on top of everything else. Here's something about how tough the Soul Taker is. It's one thing to see him in the ring, and he's not having such well, There's a smart wrestling move. He bullies people around. Do you know how tough it's got to be on your body to get that many tattoos put on? I have never I had the get, displeasure. I don't even like getting a shot for Pete's sake, and this guy's got tattoos on him like the Mona Lisa. He's got, like, the Lord's Supper tattooed on him somewhere in there, I think. This guy is really into tattoos, and that's, that shows a lot of toughness. As a matter of fact, in an interview for the 900 number recently here on the Global Wrestling Federation hotline, he told me that one of the tattoos on his, I believe, right arm is that actually of the Soul Taker, a mystical character from, I guess, the uh, Middle Ages. And right now he's trying to take the mask away from the Avenger. Well, the Avenger better be very careful. I, I don't think you can underestimate the Soul Taker just on, on face value. The man is just so big you can't underestimate him. But I don't know that the Avenger may have taken him as seriously as, his need, as he needed to because the Soul Taker is really having his way with the masked man in there. Irish whip and a chop to the throat that caught the Avenger by surprise. The Soul Taker, the former Catch Wrestling Association, European champion as he comes down with a leg drop on the Avenger. Beats Scott Hall for that honor. The current Catch Wrestling Association European champion, a man by the name of Rambo. Duck under by the Avenger, but he's not going to be able to duck under the flying clothesline. Courtesy of the Soul Taker. Six foot six, 325 pounds of bad man. And you'll notice he doesn't even wear wrestling boots into the ring. Those are, I believe, motorcycle boots. A man the size of the Soul Taker can wear any kind of boots he wants to in there. He won't get any gruff from me on that account. Double chop to the midsection, followed up by the elbow to the back of the neck. Fans still filing into the Global Dome for our first event here in the GWF. That right caught the Avenger. Right in the chops. Into the ropes with a shove and a drop kick. You don't see many 325 pound men being that agile. But indeed he was. Let's go to Bonnie. She's standing by with some Soul Taker comments. Okay, guys, we're up here with Kayla. What do you think about the Soul Taker? I think he's huge and scary. And he's doing very well here in the Global Wrestling Federation matchups. Well, the fans may be a little bit upset about the Soul Taker, and he gets the win here.